get naked. I wanna be a baby, baby, baby. Spinning in his wedges like he came from Mayday. Rockin' with it on the brownie. Then I get like this, I can't be a rockin'. Till it's been down on the notch. Cause I can make some things that I'm gon' do. Wow. We just got back from brunch and we went to this tapas place called Barcelona in Atlanta and it's one of my favorite restaurants. Got tapas, got cocktails, got gelato and I just wanted to start this week off on a positive note because this is my last week of my maternity leave. So this week is all about productivity, being as productive as possible. I have a couple of things on my to-do list and I want to just make sure that like everything is like cleared off of it before. I go back to work. I'm going to be 11 weeks postpartum on Saturday and I go back to work on Friday. So I'm kind of like, you know, I didn't get the full three months off, but I really just, you know, I want to go back to work so I can make more money. I work PRN at the hospital, so I don't get any kind of benefits. I don't get paid time off. I don't get maternity leave, nothing. So all the money that I've made this year has been saved up to be off in this postpartum period, which sucks. Like the US has terrible, like they treat moms so bad. I guess it just depends on the company that you work for. Um, but healthcare, like, I don't know. My husband, his family's from Hungary and I think they have one of the best maternity leaves in the world. Unfortunately, the US is kind of like on the bottom. I don't really know how it's gonna work with pumping and working 12 hour shifts. There's some days where I don't even get like a full 30 minute lunch break or like I don't get to eat breakfast, I don't even get to sit down. So it's like, how am I going to incorporate like four pumping sessions in a 12 hour shift? Like how am I gonna like make time for 20, 30 minutes to pump and wash my supplies and all of that stuff. And like working as a nurse, how am I gonna do that? I'm sure that nurses get it done, but I just kind of have to figure out like when I'm at work, planning my day around like my pumping breaks. Our daughter has a doctor's appointment tomorrow, her two month checkup, and she's getting her shots tomorrow. And I'm not looking forward to that either. I already know that like my whole Monday and Tuesday is gonna be dedicated to her because I'm sure that she's gonna be miserable after her vaccines. Yeah, hopefully it'll be a productive week. And if it's not, then that's okay too. But I'm putting it in the air that this week will be productive. And yeah, let's get into it. Morning guys, oh my gosh, it's Monday and I go back to work in a couple of days and each day is like giving me more anxiety. I don't know about anyone else, but every time like I am on vacation and I go back to work, I feel like I don't even know where I am, who I am, what am I doing? I'm just like really disoriented and all over the place. So I'm just like not, 
looking forward to going back to work honestly but um but it's monday and i woke up early this morning i'm trying to get my body used to waking up early just so i'm not like that groggy when i actually do return back to work on friday really i've just been trying to find like a breast pump bag and like cleaning supplies for work i found like these like breast pump wipes that are really good if you don't have access to water which i do like my our break room has a sink of course but um where i'm going to pump doesn't have a sink or water or anything like that so i thought it'd be convenient to use breast pump wipes and then like having a breast pump bag because like my breast pump has a lot of compartments to it components to it it's really my goal to get that today so that I'll have it by Friday. Okay, so I will check in with you guys a little bit later. Honestly, I was like so tired yesterday because my daughter, she was like a little bit fussy in her sleep after her vaccines. So she was up like every two, three hours. So I didn't get any sleep and I just didn't feel like doing anything yesterday, but we did get groceries, which is good. I really just want to finish up everything on my to-do list so that tomorrow I can just kind of chill. Um, so I have to ship off this package to Shein. I bought a bunch of clothes like postpartum clothes and of course like they don't fit me from Shein so I gotta return those. I pretty much went through like all the clothes in my closet and kind of like tossed everything that I didn't want or things that didn't fit me. Someone told me that I should like keep my clothes until I return back to like some of my pre-pregnancy size but honestly I just want like a new wardrobe altogether so I got a bunch of clothes so I'm gonna donate. Um, I'm gonna clean, I'm gonna wash my scrubs so that they're fresh. Honestly I don't even know if my scrubs fit me like they're probably too, they're either gonna be too big or too small so I didn't even try them on. I'll just figure it out the morning of but um but yeah so uh it is almost noon i ate breakfast my daughter she did some tummy time she's taking a nap and her dad is gonna watch her while i do all these different things so yeah i kind of want to work out today too but um but we'll see if that fits into the schedule hopefully so i um i'm trying not to let like my mom pooch bother me it is there i gotta get rid of this eventually in due time this will go i'm not used to it but it did carry my daughter created her um let's let's start today happy friday i am at work and it's 6 40 i'm at work kind of early i usually don't get to work this early um but i kind of wanted to do like a chart review on all my patients and write down like 
all my things before I actually get report. So I'm trying to stay ahead of the day. I'm pumping right now, I'm connected to it. So I'm about to disconnect and then go inside. Um, throughout the week, like I was feeling kind of anxious going back to work, but now that I'm here, I feel okay. I just feel like I just have to get it over with and get back into the rhythm of working 12 hour shifts. So hopefully it'll be a good day. And yeah, so I will check in with you guys later.